<laughs> okay. So you want me to scroll? I'm gonna do like a... Okay, yeah, that's good. good. Yeah. Hello, my name is Claudia Bariga, and I am a second year missionary with the Culture Project. I am from Tyler, Texas, and I'm super excited to get started this year. I became a missionary with the Culture Project because I couldn't help but notice all of the brokenness in the world today, and the need for hope, and the need for the gospel. So I knew that the Lord was calling me to take an active role in restoring the culture. And I could no longer just sit on the sidelines anymore and hope that somebody else would go in and do all the work for me. And I have absolutely loved my time here so far. It has changed my life. I have had a radical encounter with the Lord and um, it's been the best. My absolute favorite audience and my why, the reason that I'm here and the reason that I'm doing this again is because I love encountering high school and middle school girls. See, they are navigating love for the very first time and this great ache that we all have that is given to us by God. And what they're doing, unfortunately, is falling for the lies of our culture. And what this is doing is it's leaving them hurting and it's leaving them broken. And this is where we come in. We come in and we offer them a new perspective. We not only propose a different way to view themselves, but to view others. And that is a gift, a gift made for authentic love. And the reality is we can only love others if we believe that we are made for authentic love and worthy of it. See, I was once broken from the culture and I just hope that I can help young girls come to know and understand the freedom and joy and happiness that I have found in Christ and his church. I joined the Culture Project because middle school and high schoolers are just my favorite age group. They are the age group that are asking themselves all of the big questions and they're super eager to learn the truth. And they're asking themselves questions like, why am I here? Why does my life have purpose? Who is God? Is there a God? What happens after death? And that's where we step in and we provide them with all of these answers that they're looking for, but nobody seems to know the answers to. And this is why I'm doing a second year and I'm so excited to get started. Thank you so much.